Let's learn how to put a watermark on a document using our Foxit PDF. I have a document open here, as you can see, and we're going to navigate over to the Organize tab or ribbon, and we can see right here there is a watermark option. When we drop that down, we can add, we can update, or we can remove. Let's go ahead and add a watermark. Now when the dialog box comes up, we do get a preview here, and this is preview page one, so make sure that you're on the right page for where you want the watermark. Now we can choose a text or we can have a file as a watermark, so that would be an image. Now we're just going to say draft only. You can see right away how it appears on page one. Now on page one, if you find that that's too small, you can use the size drop down and make it larger, as you can see, or make it smaller. You can also come in here and rotate it. We have different choices. And we can make it more opaque or less opaque with our little slider. Now we can also scale relevant to the page. So that has made it a little bit larger, as we can see here and we're scaling it out. Now we can also go in here and go to Appearance Options. Show it when printing, show it when displaying, so we could clear those so that it doesn't show when printing. Now we can also go to the Page Range Options. This particular document has 16 pages. We only want it to go from page 1 to page 10. And let's say OK. So let's verify that that actually did happen. So I'm on page 1 here. Let's go to page 11, and you can see that the watermark doesn't appear. If I go up in my document, sorry, go up, page 10, it does appear. And when I say OK, the watermark is visible. Now to remove the watermark, we go back and we remove all it prompts us and we are going to say yes. And that's how we do watermarks in Foxit PDFs. If you've enjoyed this video or learned from this video, please like and subscribe.